and gentlemen, Vintage Nation, welcome to the Florida Rumble Report. I'm your host, Timothy Barr. The Florida Rumble, it all takes place Saturday night, September 13th. Downtown Orlando at the Downtown Orlando Recreation Complex. The tradition continues as we set on the road to Wrestle Brawl 6. One of the matches we have on the card that night is Afro Boy. He just won the Vintage Internet Television Championship. Well, we all remember what happened at Hurricane Havoc. And Jason Falcone losing the title without even being pinned. Falcone not too happy about it, and we'll show you why. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you saw it there. A new change in attitude by Jason Falcone. We're gonna go to Falcone right now. Afro boy, I'm coming back to get the title that you stole from me. There's no other time in my life where I felt like this is it. The Vintage Wrestling Internet Television Championship you stole from me. My daughter was in that crowd watching me. My wife was in that crowd watching me. They saw the disgust on my face and I know that I'm gonna make you feel the exact same way. So after I win the Florida Rumble, I'm gonna go in to wrestle brawl, not only the vintage wrestling internet television champion, but I'm gonna walk away with that heavyweight championship as well. You wanna say fear the fro? <laughs> no, 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 you have to fear the opportunity. Jason Falcone looking to regain that vintage internet television championship. Well, Mr. Opportunity, I don't know how easy that's going to be as you face the new vintage internet television champion, Afro Boy. And Mr. Opportunity, Afro Boy has some words for you. On September the 13th, Florida Rumble, Vintage Nation witnesses the first title defense of the new Vintage Internet TV Champion, yours truly, Afro Boy. Sounds good, don't it? Except Jason Falcone has a problem with that. He shakes my hand, and as I think we're celebrating together, he turns and kicks me in my nether region. Well, Falcone, I'm gonna let you know, since you're a little unstable, that I will defend my title successfully. And after I defend my title, we got a rumble to settle. 30 men, one opportunity with my name on it. See, this shoulder's a little lonely. I think I can carry two straps. Go in the Wrestle Brawl main event against whoever the champ may be at the time, because it doesn't matter. There will only be one survivor, and you're looking at him. I need the matching strap to go with this beautiful one. So, all gentlemen, be on alert. Because you will know why you should fear the fro. Ladies and gentlemen, the Tag Team Initiative has been put in motion by General Manager Big P Cannon. Vintage Wrestling setting a new standard in the world of Tag Team Wrestling. 
It's gonna be fan favorites, the buddy system. Mikey and Super Grover against the former WWF Tag Team Champions, Mosh and Thrasher, the Headbangers. Mikey and Super Grover have a few words for Mosh and Thrasher. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Josh Johnson for Vintage Wrestling, and I'm being joined by one half of the buddy system, Grover. September 13th, you have the Headbangers and the Florida Rumble. Florida Rumble, a big opportunity, and we have the Headbangers. I'm so excited! No, Where's you're my... gonna be more excited! You're totally gonna need this, Grover. I got great news. I talked to Uncle Pete. We're one and two in the Rumble. That's terrible news. No, that's great news. We can be together, one and two. Why'd you do that? Because I want my own promo. Listen, we got the Headbangers. This is gonna be awesome. It's an opportunity of a lifetime. And I get to win the Rumble. <laughs> Vintage Nation, we are going down that road to Wrestle Brawl 6. But before we get there, at the Florida Rumble, the Vintage Heavyweight Championship will be on the line. It'll be John Davis accompanied to the ring by the beautiful Miss Shane Doe, challenging for that heavyweight title against your reigning heavyweight champion, the King of Florida, Francisco Chiazzo. Earlier this afternoon, we spoke to the champ. Ladies and gentlemen, I am Josh Johnson, and on September the 13th, it has been signed, sealed, and will be delivered. Francisco Chiazzo, the Vintage Heavyweight Champion, will be facing the future John Davis. John Davis, 280 pounds. The irresistible force meets the immovable object. The King of Florida, Francisco Chiazzo, and yourself are no strangers to one another. September 13th, Florida Rumble, my Vintage Heavyweight title is on the line. 30 men are walking into a ring that night to get a shot at 20 pounds of gold at Wrestle Brawl 6. If you think I'm letting go of this belt, you're sadly mistaken. Because I'm going to Wrestle Brawl 6. Makes no difference to me who it is. Whether it's Corey Chavis, whether it's Mike Cruz, Milo Beasley, or hell, even my brother from another mother, Simon Says. Oh yeah, I said it. September 13th, future John Davis, King of Florida, Francisco Chiazzo, coming at you live and in color. All hail, hashtag, Supreme Fachin. Vintage Nation, you have the ability to make hashtag Supreme Fachin trend worldwide. Now, let's discuss the main event. The 30-man Florida Rumble. This is what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen. 30 men enter the ring, one man leaves with the opportunity to headline to main event to challenge for the Vintage Heavyweight Championship at Wrestle Brawl 6. Wrestle Brawl, the biggest event of the year. It is hands down the largest event in independent professional wrestling today. Earlier this afternoon, we had the opportunity to catch up with some of these participants. Let's hear from them now. September the 13th, Florida Rumble. It's not 30 men, one opportunity. It's one killer, 29 victims. Your next vintage heavyweight champion. Let me explain something to you. I got a lot going on up here right now, but all that's to the side. Tunnel vision, your next vintage champion. Beast Mode, Billy Wood, I'll deal with you later. But first things first, the soul assassin Corey Chavis has done this two times in a row. September the 13th, make it three. And after that, Billy Wood and Beast Mode get real acquainted with your God because you're gonna meet him when I'm done with you. Damn you, Mike Cruz. I had the vintage heavyweight title around my waist for months. I had a roof over my head, I had food on my plate, and I had clothing for Bearsley, but not anymore, thanks to you. But on September 13th, I get that opportunity for redemption. September 13th, I get the opportunity to put that roof back over my head. Well, it's a Holiday Inn, a Red Roof Inn, it doesn't matter. My days at the shelter are numbered. Because come September 13th, I win the Florida Rumble, I go on to Wrestle Brawl, and I win that belt again. Then I will deal with you. 
But for now, I have 29 other guys who I have to deal with. I'm not happy. September 13th, 2014. Downtown Orlando, Florida. The Florida Rumble. 30 All-Stars, one opportunity. 30 All-Stars, my opportunity. Because you see, far too long, I've been chasing the Mayweather known as the Vintage Heavyweight Championship. And now, it's within my grasp. Francisco Chiazzo, John Davis, you two bulls are gonna lock horns for the championship. And it makes no difference to me who comes out on top, but it does make a difference to you that it's the Emerald Demper you'll be defending that championship against at Wrestle Brawl 6. Because come September 13th, 29 other souls are gonna go flying over those ropes and one man is gonna be left standing. His name is Simon Says. So whether you like it or you don't like it, Whoever comes out with that championship, learn to love it because Simon Says is coming for the gold. And that's not just what Simon promises. That's not just what Simon guarantees. That Vintage Nation is what Simon Says. Vintage Nation, as you can see, emotions already running high. What's gonna happen if let's say the Emerald Emperor wins the Florida Rumble? If Corey Chavis three-peats Unbelievable, anything is possible on this very night. It is Saturday night, September 13th, the Florida Rumble, the road to Wrestle Brawl 6. On behalf of Josh Johnson, General Manager Big Pete Cannon, his assistant Brian Rubright, and all of us here at Vintage Wrestling, we look forward to seeing each and every one of you at the Florida Rumble, Saturday night, September 13th, Orlando, Florida at the Downtown Orlando Recreation Complex. For tickets, go to VintageWrestlingFL.com. We'll see you at the Florida Rumble.